Hey girl, hey. So you are looking to start your body mist collection, but you don't know where to start? I got the ones for you. I just started my collection. Let's go ahead and get into it. What is up, beautiful? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'd like to welcome you. Please consider subscribing. It's lovely over here. And if you are oldie but a goodie, welcome back. And hey girl. So today I wanted to talk to you about my Body Works collection that I have been working on. I know you guys seen me build this collection gradually and I am in love with it. I didn't know where to start originally so I watched a lot of YouTube videos and got some ideas. So I wanted to start by telling you some of the classics. I don't have everything. I'm giving you the ones that are available right now. As you know with Bath and Body Works, they start something and then they'll just continue it. They may bring it back under another name. They may not bring it back. So I am showing you the ones that are available online at this moment that I think are fabulous and worth your coin. So if I don't mention some that you may be in love with, I probably just haven't got a chance to purchase it because I'm really only buying on sale as well as using my free gifts from Bath and Body Works. So if I don't mention some that you know are available online, I may have not have gotten around to getting it yet. I'm just showing you from my workable collection. So these are in no particular order. Some of these you might already have in your collection. You're just trying to expound, okay? So I get it. So let's get into In the Stars. I absolutely love this one. This is on your grown woman, but it's fresh, light, crisp, airy. It's so pretty. The notes in it is starflower, sandalwood musk, sugar tangelo, white argawood, and radiant amber. This is definitely a classic. It's definitely good for all times. I love this. I would say it's more of a dressy, casual scent. It's beautiful. I see why people love it, and that's in the stars. Next up, let's go to Pure Wonder. I just got this one. This one is a sweeter. Oh, it's so pretty. The notes in this one is Ice Rose, Star Jasmine, Warm White Amber. It doesn't really give rose to me. It's such a soft, sweet, beautiful scent. I cannot wait to wear this one. And this is pure wonder. So next up is fairy tale. This one is such a pretty one as well. I love this one. The notes in it are pomegranate nectar, orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber. So the ones that have more amber in them definitely give me more, more of a perfume vibe. Beautiful, beautiful scent. A lot of people are crazy about this one, and I see why. It's luscious, and this is fairy tale. Next up is You're the One. So I've had this one for a minute. I haven't been wearing them. I feel like I'm saving these. These are definitely more perfumes than body mist to me, in my opinion. The longevity, I think, will be better if paired with a perfume, but beautiful. So this one has white birch, velvet tea rose, and a drop of strawberry nectar so pretty this one's definitely a beautiful one and that's you're the one next up you guys i feel is a classic i don't know about everybody else but that's dream bright i absolutely love this scent i just purchased another bottle of this because in the winter i've been wearing it out so beautiful now this one it has a berry but perfume berries at the same time. Okay, so the notes in it as sapphire berries, night blooming orchard, and crystallized vanilla. It's so pretty. If you haven't tried this, I do recommend that you try it if you love berries and vanilla. And this is Dream Bright. Next up is fairly new to me as well, and that's Coco Paradise. But I'm definitely in love with this one. It's got to be a classic. If you like coconut scents, you have to try this one. It's giving coconut in a perfume way. So pretty, clean, just beautiful, you guys. So the notes are salted coconut manoi, sugared neroli, and bronze sandalwood. It's beautiful. 
such a beautiful guide i definitely love this one in my book it's a classic next up is at the beach this one is definitely a classic so the notes in it are white finger painting blossoms toasted coconut bergamot waters sea salt breeze and sun-kissed musk oh you guys this one is so pretty and it pairs well with some beautiful perfumes it is so high quality it's beautiful i love this one i'm gonna have to get the bigger bottle of this one because i am in love with it and that's so this next set of body mist you guys in my opinion they're underrated i don't hear a lot of talk about them but they're fabulous and i'm going to tell you why i think they're fabulous and you would need them in your collection first off let's start with rose I don't hear a lot of people talk about this one. The notes in it are airy rose water, jasmine petals, and creamy musk. This one definitely gives rose water. It's not that overbearing, heavy, heavy rose that will make you nauseated. It is nothing like that, but it's definitely a classic in my opinion. If you love rose, you would definitely want to give this one a try because it's beautiful, it is so pretty, and it lasts on the skin. Next up, you guys, I feel is underrated, is Sun, Bloom, and Suede. I love this one. It's This one is so pretty to me. Mm. It's something about, I guess, the raspberry notes. Let me give you the notes. It's white raspberry, pink petals, and vanilla cream. It's the raspberries and the vanilla cream for me. Oh my goodness. This one smells expensive to me. I feel like I said these are underrated. Sun Bloom and Suede. You have to lay your nose on it if you like it. I think you definitely need to add it to your collection. Next up, you guys, is Bahamas, but Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower. I think this one has been out for a while, but when I tell you this one I am in love with I am in love with this one it is so beautiful okay so the notes in it are passion fruit pineapple leaves and banana flower I get all of that the banana is a banana flower although I do get hints of banana I pick up the sweetness of the pineapple it is so pretty and light and I think it pairs well with so many things. It could just sweeten up anything. Beautiful, divine. I love this. Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower. Beautiful. Next up, I don't hear a lot about Love Always Wins. This is also a very pretty one. In my opinion, it gives classic vibes. I love it. It gives a fresh, clean, cotton scent. The notes in this one is golden star fruit, fresh coconut water, and cedarwood heart. This is so pretty to me, you guys. I think it is so pretty, and I think it is very much underrated. Love always wins. You have to try it out. Next up is saltwater breeze. This one I passed up for a while because of the name. The bottle is pretty, but I just didn't like the name. Saltwater breeze, what does that sound like? I think it could have been named better, but this one very pretty it's very pretty the notes in it are fresh linen violet leaves and water blossoms and white musk so beautiful you have to lay your nose on it i think this is very much a next up is sweet petal pound cake this is another one that i passed on because i heard that it had rose as well as pound cake scent i didn't know how that go but once i laid my nose on it I'm in love with it. It is classic as well to me. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. This one is candied rose, raspberry swirl, and frosted bun cake. I did not include any gourmands in this. I'm basically giving classic, classic body mist in my opinion. Although this one says sweet petal pound cake, it's more of a floral tone, but it's so pretty. Absolutely love this one. If you can try it, if you love it, definitely add this one to your collection. Nice. You guys, I want to talk about Pastel Skies. 
This one I have fallen, fallen in love with. It is not gourmand, but it's definitely sweet. I love this one. I love wearing this one. It is so beautiful. It's soft cloud berries, pink sponge sugar, and coconut musk. This one has a light density, very airy, cloud-like, but sweet and beautiful in the best way. I absolutely love this one. I think you can pair it with so many things. It's very sweet, but it's also a classic in my opinion. So you guys, like I said, I didn't mention any gourmands. I didn't add any, mention any fruit, body mist. These are basically classic scents in my opinion that I feel are just beautiful that I will always repurchase and I'm in love with. So these are some, if you're interested in starting your collection, you might want to give a try, try it out, see how you like it. I hope you found value in this video. And don't forget to leave me a comment to let me know if you have any of these in your collection. And hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Take care.